In the World Wide Web, the nonsensical and illogical comments of the underworld are hunted by the detectives of the Dusty Comments, Email Crime Unit. These are their stories. You're jealous. You're wrong. WTF, pray for wisdom. Your God booted your ass out paradise just for knowledge. You think you would got it if you just asked. And also how the F did. God not know what the snake was up to. Good Lord, your response to his video is incredibly meaningless. Most things you agreed with him on, while also having issues with him saying things like little baby sacrifices, as if you weren't giving him an ounce of charity to actually understand what he was trying to convey. There were many times in this video where just a bit of charity would have gone a long way. If you actually believe that he didn't represent your faith correctly, or that you thought that his points weren't on the same line of reasoning you adhere to, then maybe the video wasn't talking about Christians like you, Jason. This was absolutely painful to watch, but you're welcome for the view. If you don't believe in abortion, don't have one. No uterus. STFU. Your channel is trash, get a job, homie, and leave the good doctor alone. He's beneficial for black people who loves black people and care for black people only. Me Bible say so. Hey, I've got a prime piece of oceanfront property in Nebraska to sell you. What? You want to see it? Well, the deed says it's there. Happy New Year to all those Christians who will walk away from Christianity's voluntary suspension of reason in 2024. Come on over. The view is fantastic from here. And I promise you won't burn in that imaginary hell. At the Walker Christian. You got nada in the way of explanatory power regarding an old book you were indoctrinated to believe. I demand you answer for your religion as is clearly stated in 1 Peter 3.15. Or suffer God's wrath for not doing as he commands you. I have. I studied religion for five years, and it's all lies on top of more lies. It's nonsense, all of it. The Bible is the worst, Adam is the father of all beasts, and named all beasts. No, we do that scientifically. We're still finding strange new animals. Noah's Ark is 100%. Best you can't get two of every animal on a boat the Bible tells you. He did on top of that. There isn't enough water on this planet to flood it. If there was, it would all still be underwater. So where did all the water go? Unless aliens came and took it all, the world would still be flooded. Moses. Whole life was to free the slaves in Egypt. He helped your God murder the firstborn of every family in Egypt, then drowned their armies in the Red Sea, all to free the slaves then. Two men later comes down the mountain after talking to God with Ten Commandments, and not one of them condemns slavery. Really, you just murdered how many Egyptians over evil? Slavery then you don't mention it in your commandments. Wow, what a kick in the crotch. Just another thing. The Bible got wrong. There is no freedom in religion. I'll give a few examples. Christians like Muslims can't eat pork. They can't eat shellfish. They can't question their holy books. They can't learn anything, only worship. Imagine being well-versed in a thing that Bronze Age goat herders made up. Brandon, this is totally unrelated, but I just read the last three chapters of Judges over again. As an atheist, without my god glasses on. And I was horrified to read what I read. Be like Jesus? Well, let's see. What was Jesus like at 10, at 18, at 23, at 26, at 30? And then, of course, he dies at 33, so there's no example for 35, 40, 45, 50, etc. Jesus' story includes a birth, a prodigy at 12, and a wandering ministry at 30, for three years. Maybe that's what he's referring to. When you are going to stop ghosting him, as you claim him doing to you. Love that you're giving Brandon a second home. Living rent-free in your head. Christian charity at its finest. Why would anyone worship a god? That gives you permission to beat your slaves. Exodus 21, 20 and 21. Do you, if what you said helps you live apart from God, carry on. At Dear with Christian Cole, are you going to answer my question? Sure. I want to clarify. Is this your only issue? When I answer your question on this topic what will impede you from submitting to God and putting your full trust and hope in Christ, 
I would like an answer in order to continue this discussion. If God showed himself to me and proved he existed, I would no longer be an atheist, however. I believe the very concept of worship is immoral so I would not worship, love or respect that kind of God. Why haven't you read the Bible? You do realize the fastest way to atheism is reading the Bible. I'm sure you've heard other atheists say that. Is that why you don't read the Bible? Bro Omar A. Goat